Hey guys. Good okay. morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Okay. Looks like we got some people that want to learn about Mammy Chat. <laughs> Shiny object for you. You're welcome. It's going to be pretty amazing. So um, how many of you guys use Manny Chat keywords now? Ooh, Bonnie. <laughs> we got a no way <laughs> ever. Okay, so it seems very complicated, but it's really not. Um, it's like, I don't know what she needs in her seats. Okay, that would be my brother-in-law, Bobby. Hi, Bobby. Yep, learning about Manny Chat keywords. So we're going to let everybody in. And uh, basically what Manny Chat does, it helps you with automation. You guys have heard me talk about automation over and over and over um, because it's super important, right? There's so many times that I'm missing messages. Like people are messaging me, people are commenting and I'm not seeing the comments, you know, I'm not liking their comments. It's so important to like and comment their comment, right? So, um, so anyway, Manny Chat helps you automate all of that. It's a little, little robot, um, but you can make it sound like you, or you can say, hey, you know, this is my little bot sending you a present, <laughs> you know, so that people don't think that you are literally sending them something in a millisecond. <laughs> You know, oh, that realtor is really busy. She got back to me in two seconds, <laughs> you know? So uh, you may want to tell people it's your little bot in your pocket. But um, anyway, there are so many different ways to use it. So uh, my, like, I can't even sleep at night thinking about how many ways I can use keywords, right? So for the most part, my main keywords are tech. You know, so if I do anything on Tech Tuesday, I run an ad and I say, if you want to watch this full video or join, join our free Facebook group, type tech in the comments below. And then when people type tech, guess what? My group link goes right into their messenger and they join our group. How cool is that? Has anybody joined my group from the Manny chat? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> I'm sure. I'm sure it's a little bit more than that. Anyway, so we have had some people do that, which is cool. Uh, another way I use it is uh, for like lists of homes, right? So we do a lot of Las Vegas pool homes because it's hot AF here, right? Everybody needs a pool. So we do, you know, little videos about wanting a pool, showing them how cool it would be to have a pool. And then, oh, if you want a list of pool homes, just type pool in the comments below. And then guess what gets sent to their inbox? A list of pool homes in Las Vegas. Isn't that cool? So you can like, you're, my, you're, you're not going to get anything done today because you're going to be thinking about all these ways you can use Manny Chat. Um, you can also use keywords like buy, you know, if you're, you know, maybe you're giving people buyer tips in a video or a little PDF or, you know, whatever words on screen, whatever it is, it doesn't have to be a video. It doesn't have to be a picture. Like it could be anything. Um, but whatever your post may be, uh, you know, you could even put it on your post type, blah, blah, blah in the comments below or type buy in the comments below, you know, and then you can send them to either, you know, your buyer funnel, like, you know, to teach them all the things on how to buy a house or maybe just like a home search, you know, so you could get them out there looking, right? They'll eventually end up in your database, I promise. So anyway, or you could do sell, like maybe you're talking about home values are all over the place right now and they're changing by the second, you know, type sell in here to find out your home's value. And then when they type sell, guess what? You're going to send them your link to your home value page, right? This is all free. These are not even paid ads. Yes, you could actually run an ad on them and get even more sells and buys, right? So, um, so you could do that, but I'm going to hop into it and kind of show you what I'm talking about so that you know exactly uh, what we're looking at here. Um, if you don't have Manny Chat, Joanne's going to drop a link in the chat 
uh, for you to uh, get signed up. Some of these things that I'm going to be talking about today are from the pro version. So there's that. Okay, so uh, you are going to go into ManyChat. Here, let's go back here. And into automation, right? So uh, so as you can see, I have a couple of things set up for automations, like a lot. But uh, if you put keyword here, you can do add new keyword. So we're just going to do one because uh, I just posted a video and I'm going to create this and then you guys are going to, I'm going to share the link with you and then you're going to type, you're going to like it and you're going to type what I say in the comments and then you're going to see what you get in Messenger. Okay. So um, that's what we're going to do. So we're going to build it first. So I'm going to, okay, I'm going to trash this because, yeah, because I'm going to make a new one. So add new keyword, right? Keyword is going to be Veer. This is my high rise condo. And you used to have to like type in different variations, like all caps, title case, small case, but you don't have to do that anymore. It recognizes them as all. So um, let's say I told them to do Veer Towers like this, right? Veer Towers in the comments below. Uh, that way it, they can get to that. Uh, you could do that or maybe they might do different, you know, like space between. So you could do different variations of your words. Um, but this one is just going to be Veer because I like to try to keep it simple. So Veer. Oh, I already made that. So hold on. Veer. There we go. Veer is our word. Okay. So, um, and then you're going to select the channel. So you can do this on Facebook or in Instagram. So we're going to start off with Facebook and then we're just going to click create. And then uh, we're going to click on create new reply. And then I'm going to click on this. So this is if they send a message, I'm going to click new trigger. And I'm going to do uh, user clicks a Facebook ad. That's an ad. User comments on your post. So um, I'm going to do that one. And then I'm going to click specific post, right? Because otherwise you can actually do it for all your posts. Like, hey, thanks for following. <laughs> You're amazing. Thanks for commenting. Whatever you want to say. But we're going to be very specific. So um, we're going to do a specific post. And I'm going to select the publication of, oh, it's not showing up on my feed yet. Darn it. Okay. <sighs> Let's find it. This one, strip most, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So we're going to do this one. This is also Vera Cal there. Um, so we're going to do that one. And then we're going to say comment contains specific words and it's going to be beer. Okay. And then you want to auto respond to them. So uh, you're auto responding in the comment section, uh, but you want to make sure that all of your auto responders are like a few of them are different because if Facebook sits there and sees you doing the same autoresponder to everybody that comments, uh, you'll be shut down. So we're going to say, I mean, you can be, <laughs> you can be shut down. Okay. So we're going to say, uh, sweet. Can't type while there's people trying to enter. Darn it. Sweet. Check your DMs. And then we're going to do a little emoji there. Then we're going to do a new response. Say, you are going to love 
this. See how you can like make it sound like you? I said gonna. Um, sent to your DMs. Here. And you can even like maybe take this out. Do a little heart right here. Okay. New response, letting Rachel in. There we go. Uh, and then awesome. Sent to your DMs. You get the idea, right? So have a couple different um responses. I'm gonna do like a high rise here. Uh, so I'm gonna create one more. Um You gotta just kind of tell people what to do. Otherwise they won't even know to check their DMs. So, so there's that. And I'm gonna click save. So now when someone clicks on that post, I wanna view this on Facebook so I can send you guys the right one. We're not gonna look at that right now. Anyway, so they're going to uh, then, see how it like makes a little thing here? Then you're gonna click on this. And then you're gonna say, um, Click below for more for more pics videos and info for this sweet high rise condo. Okay, and then you're gonna click add button and you're gonna say, uh, beer, power, beer, condo, beats. Okay, so then you're gonna say open website. So where do you want to send them? We have a website specifically for uh, all of our properties that has pictures, video, and info. So I'm going to send them to that. Going back to Manny Chat, and we'll go here, right? And then you can do additional actions, perform, add action, and you can add like a tag, Veer. That way I know I can actually do a search later and, and search for everybody that did this, right? So it makes it easy to search. So anyway, how easy was that? This is what it looks like. This is what they're gonna get. And then we're gonna set live. Oh, shoot. Uh, you want to as comment or reply, set live. There we go. Then I'm going to go here and I'm going to share this link, uh, copy link, stop share, going into your chat. Okay, so there's the link. If you type beer in the comments, maybe like it, give it some love. Type Veer in the comments. Look at, look at how much exposure I'm getting my seller. This is amazing. <laughs> anyway, um, then you're going to get the message and go directly uh, and be able to click that link and go right into the property website. Pretty cool, huh? Very cool. Okay. Now. Did you, did you stop sharing? I did because oh, I put a I link make sure in the chat. Yeah, I put the link in the chat. Okay. Yes, this is, uh, Cynthia, this is through uh, your business Facebook page and your Instagram page. So those are the two places you could do this. 
So um, if you go back to here, let's say you want to set up another automation uh, for Instagram, right? So you're going to go here. Oops. That's not what I wanted. Oh. Wendy, it's giving an error message. The the message in the chat? Yeah. yeah no. Mine went, mine no went I, I went to the website and it says that it, the video cannot be played now. Oh, mine came up. I'm not, it's mine came up too. Back. Mine did as well. It worked <laughs> on my end. Mine's okay. Ah, okay. Thank you. Thank you for the Mine feedback. came up. <laughs> okay. All right. I had so to do mine then, twice. I'm going to go back to automation and then click on keywords. And then you're going to do a new keyword. And this time it's going to be Veer. But it's going to be for Instagram. Right? You got to do both. It doesn't let you do both at the same time. But there is a little time saver here. Hold on. So if I go create. And then you can select existing right? To do the same thing that we just did on the other one. Um, okay. I want to do, I want to make sure I pick the right one because I was playing around with it this morning. Oh, let's see. Oh, this must be it. Look, I already have 13 hits of 84%. <laughs> see, it even, even tells you. So I want to click this one. And then I want to pick this automation and boom. That's just now. Oh. That huh? just happened right now. Yeah. Wow. That's so cool. I know. Right? So um, I just want to click edit really quick. No. Everyone in your this. Tech Tuesday is, yeah. is responding there. Is that what you're talking about? Yes. Your Tech Tuesday VIP so group? Okay. That's yeah, that's the 13 people that just typed beer um, in, inside the thing. So this, oh, wait a minute. So I need to change this to, okay, that didn't work. So, so Wendy, I have a quick, a quick question on Instagram. So your Facebook video was already out there. So do you post your Instagram video out there and then do this as well? Or do you do this in all while you're setting it all up? Right, so so I, I post on my personal and you guys all know I use Repurpose.io, right? So it goes, that video will go to my Instagram, will go to my Facebook business page, will go to my TikTok, will go to my uh, YouTube, it will go to my LinkedIn, right? So it's going to go to all the places. Uh, but the thing is, is like you could use, reuse one. So like if you have a seller one, you could create the sell, you know, type sell in the comments and go to my home value page. And you can put that in your comments. So if I go here, so if I go here, this is looking for, um, a home in Las Vegas, you might want one with a pool to stay cool. Type pool in the comments below to start shopping today. So they type pool in the comments right here. And then they're getting a list of pool homes in Las Vegas. And then you just so can go here and like their stuff. When you, perp when you post through repurpose, repurpose io it goes across all of your platforms so do you have to set up you have to set up many chit for each one of those posts for each plat for facebook and instagram so your keyword can be used on multiple posts it, like i did a specific okay. post just because it was beer condos but okay, let's say i wanted to do you know join me at exp type tribe in the comments below I can okay. use that same keyword on all okay. um, oh my, like tons of different posts. And okay. whenever anybody types tribe in any of my posts, they're going to automatically get a little mini mastermind link, you know? Okay. To so once you link. set the keyword, you're good. Yes. Okay. Yes. Got it. 
Got it. You just Sorry. have to see how when you set up and you post a comment, mm -hmm. you actually will type whatever keyword you want to make happen. So if yeah. you set up the keywords there, then uh, you're going to be able to do that. So we're going to do this one more time for keywords, new keyword. Uh, I want to delete this firm. And then I want to do Veer. And then this is going to be for Instagram. And then we're going to go through the motions create new reply because the other one went into my messenger. I want it to go into my Instagram messenger. So this one is going to be user comments on your post or reel, user replies to your story. So like you can like send, you could set up whatever you want. I like the posts. And then right here for Instagram, it's going to say like, here's my beer towers. Um, I'm going to select that one because that's the one I want to use. And then uh, you're going to click continue and then you're going to go beer. Okay. And then uh, continue. And you could do any comment. Like if anybody comments on anything, you can set something up to say hi or whatever. So um, this one is going to be uh, sent the link to your DMs. This is pretty powerful. Oh my like, gosh. Amazing. This is amazing. Yeah. <laughs> like you took the word right out of my mouth. Yeah. What it what of what you're doing is not available on the free plan. I know you said you you're on the pro plan. I am on the pro. If you so I think you have to you have to pick a post for the keywords. I, I don't know. I haven't had a free account like so ever. So I'm not sure exactly what they offer. Um, check your DMs. All I know is that when I tried to do what I wanted to do with keywords, it wasn't working. Like, I don't even think I saw keywords. Like I've been helping people in VIP. Hey, set up their keywords. how are you? And we're going to mute Stacy. There we go. Um, anyway, uh, and I, I can't even see that they have keywords under their automation. So I, I think it's definitely a pro version. So why is this not letting me put a phone here? There we Sorry. Go. Do you have That's an okay. affiliate? Do you have an affiliate code? Like we'll get a discount if we yeah. go through your link. Uh, yeah, I don't know what it is. All I know is they give me affiliate link. So Joanne will put it in the chat and then you can yes, click yes. on it and figure it out. Uh, the thing is, is even if you do like a free 14 day trial or whatever it is, um, you still don't have access to the keywords. So I say switch to pro so you can do the keywords. That's that's my um, that's my opinion. And then when because you click that, when you click that link, it asks you for your Facebook login or should you just go ahead and log in with the email address? I always log in with my Facebook so that I don't have to remember passwords. Okay, got you it. You don't have to. Though. You can do whatever you want. Um, since I uh, can't type when people are trying to come in, so it takes a minute. Okay, sent to DMs. We are done. Okay. So this one is going to be set up here, save, and then that is saved there. So it's important to set those up because you want to make sure that you're responding to them and telling them what to do. If you just send it to their DMs, they may not even see it. Like I don't even see my messages in Instagram because I'm, I'm just not very active in there. So now you're going to say, um, click below for uh, more kicks oh, another page I don't videos want to, I want to switch and um uh, picks videos and info you click the click below okay. for more picks videos and okay. info okay. about this tweet I write 
I want to make it. I want to make it official because I don't want to mess it up. Okay. So then, add button. Um, beer. Beer condo. Beats. And then there's this little condo high rise there. Open website. Oops, that was a Facebook link. Hold on. Ooh, make sure I get this one. Copy. Okay. And then perform action add beer. Okay. So this is what's going to happen. This is what's going to happen. And I'm telling you, there's so much more that you could do with Manny Chat. Like you could literally ask people for their email. Once they send you the email, you can set up a zap that goes right into your CRM. Like it's freaking game changer stuff. This is a super basic class. So I just wanted to get you guys going on this specific feature because it's amazing. So, uh, so now I'm going to go to, we just did Instagram, right? So if I go here and I refresh and you go here, <gasps> no, copy link, stop share, pasting here. Okay. So now if you go to Instagram, this is a different post, you can click on it and, um, and type beer in the comments and you should get a message through there. Thank you for helping me get more exposure for my listing. Okay. So, uh, feel free to say something else in the comments too, but yeah, you got to type the keyword in order to get the message. Gregory, good morning. How's it going? Good morning. Thank you. All right. Hi. So I fall behind in my CRM. So I have the Mashore method and I have a mini chip set up. And if I don't go into the Mashore method every day, all of a sudden there's a bunch of people in there that are new contacts with conversations. And I got to look into it. What what daily routine do you do with these new people that come into your your CRM? You know, you have those conversations, it's all there, but now it's a new person in CRM. And I I'm having a hard time of because also I'll, I'll let a day or two go by and there's a bunch of conversations <laughs> that I gotta go remember what it was even about. Luckily, right. you know, all the conversations right there in the CRM, but so it's... I try to send them something like information on the Veer Tower, right? And if they give you their, their information, you know, then um, then you're definitely sending that again in an email. But like if it's a list of pool homes, you know, that they want, they're getting they're getting the thing. So don't feel like that's the perfect part about automation is they're actually getting the thing. So you can literally be sleeping at two o'clock in the morning and someone can do this and it's going to send it. You know, so, so they are getting it. Don't, don't feel like they're going to think you're ignoring them, you know? Um, uh, and then like, if it is a pool home search for Las Vegas, right? Guess what? We just go and set them up on a pool home search in Las Vegas so they can keep getting pool homes every day. So stuff like that. So it just depends on what, um, what they're commenting on. And I know you're like, I got to try to figure out what it is, but you should be able to see it in your conversations, whatever was sent to them, right? Yes. So whatever was sent to them, you know exactly where they came from and what they're looking for, you know, and then obviously reach out if they have any questions, but, but, you know, maybe if they didn't respond to that Veer Tower uh, listing, maybe do a search for Veer Tower you know, and create that squeeze page and send them a link to that or set them up on Veer Tower listings. You know what I mean? So yes. that's saying everything. Well, it, so. In mine, it's all conversation. So there's, I'll have my kids post about something and all their friends are commenting and it's throwing into my CRM. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, 
I, yeah, I, I don't, I don't have that fun. And so I have all I these. Used to, and not only was in gymnastics and playing softball, like my whole yeah. feed was kids. Or and yeah. all the real estate agents now, all so all their comments for all the real estate agents are going in there when I'm setting up showings or they're setting up showings with me. It's all going in there, and then I'm like, okay, I got to create a category just for realtors and throw it over. Yeah, so we also have action plans, like depending on if it's a seller, a buyer, or an agent, we have action plans. We work out a follow up boss, so we have our okay. action plan all in follow up boss. So when they come in, you know, they'll have a tag, you know, um, and a source of where they came from. And so we know what action plan to set them up on. So there's that. Does that Thanks. help? Yep. You're Thank you. I know I have the same problem, like, I, cause we have to look at our messages in messenger in Facebook, or I mean, in, in Instagram messages, TikTok messages, LinkedIn messages, like emails, text messages. Sometimes I'm getting messages and like, it's gone from my phone and I don't even know where it came from. And I'm sitting there trying to find it. I know struggle is real. I don't know. I wish we could have everything go to one place. That would be amazing. If you could work on making that, let me know. John, good morning. <laughs> Good morning. How are you? Thank you. Very interesting. Um, but I am curious, how do you align this with what you're doing in street text and what you're doing in follow-up box? Because you, right. you don't so, want to send content from all of these things to the same person in the same time frame, right? Right. So this is just uh, doing your regular posts, right? I but see. you can absolutely run an ad. So like, say you want to run an ad through street text, you put the keyword in there, right? Of what they need to say. And then instead of them clicking learn more, you know, cause sometimes that looks a little spammy. You uh -huh. don't even have to have that. You just wait for them to reply. And then ManyChat will automatically send it through their messenger. And then the coolest thing about messenger is that you're actually having a conversation with people, right? Yeah. So, our Facebook leads, yes, the struggle is real. Half of the phone numbers are wrong. Half the emails are wrong. But when you are chatting with someone through Messenger, like it's the real deal. You're actually talking to the person, right? And you have less of a chance of them saying, I didn't click that. It's like, you just freaking did. You literally just clicked on it, right? So anyway, um, so I love that because then you don't have to hunt down the records. And it's funny because I learned this from Chris Harden. He is amazing, right? He uh, actually built my Manny chat for me for a listing bot that he uses on my listings. You guys have heard me talk about um, his um, his company called Book Me Solid. And it literally books you solid. Like we are having hundreds of conversations with uh, buyers about our listings. So when we get a listing, he puts it on. He goes, you know, he just does a couple teaser photos for more info, you know, pics and video, click here. And it goes right into Messenger. And then he has a Manny chat bot chatting with them. Like, is this the perfect home for you? And they say no. And then he says, oh, would you prefer a thing? story and they say yes and then he's like oh do you have a house to sell in order to buy yes oh are you working with a realtor no okay great what's your address I mean literally it's not an AI it is just a bot he sets up all these questions and it just works so good don't ask me how to do that that's why I pay him I know how to do a simple keyword <laughs> and that's what we're learning today <laughs> But when I when I started using him, I was like, oh my God, this is amazing because you're literally having conversations with people. With That's people weird. and you're not trying to find them. And I kept telling him, you know, they're not giving me their email or phone number. And he's like, Wendy, stop. Why do you care? You're literally talking to the person right there. You don't need their email and phone number. <laughs> Send it through Messenger. And I was like, oh, okay. You know, because we are so programmed to need an email and phone number every single time, right? So this way, we really don't need it. I mean, I still like it. I still want it. But, you know, if I'm having conversations with people and they're totally fine doing th things through Messenger and feel better about that than giving me a fake email, hell yeah. Like, let's go, right? So 
John, you have, did that answer that your covers question? Me. That covers me. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Stacy. So comment a little bit more about Book Me Solid. So I, of course, Googled that while we were on, while you were talking about it. And it is um, transform your real estate leads into appointments. Is that the right one? Listings. Yep. So, okay. So, so tell me he has a couple different a little... programs. The listing mm -hmm. bot I'm talking about is the one I have through ManyChat. Um, but he does have a couple different programs. Uh, he does, he's huge on SEO and building out, you know, people's uh, websites to make them stand out in front of a bunch of agents, you know, or I mean, stand out from your competitors, you know, so he's really good. He, he's just super smart. He's a smart guy. You should know him. You should definitely know him. So, so do you have an affiliate code for him too? Uh, no, just tell him you know me and he'll hook you up. Um, Chris, what? But Chris Harden, H-A-R-D-I-N. But the link to go there is Book Me Solid. Yeah, I, I found the link. Yeah, bookmesolid.com. Yeah, bookmesolid.com. <laughs> There's a listing bot. And then he does some search optimizations for websites, stuff like that. But yeah, just connect with him, see what he has um, and see what you want to do. But but yeah, I, I had to have two agents inside my messenger. That's how many messages I had that would have to respond to these people. Like, I mean, the bot responds to them, but you need to hop in as a human, right? And I couldn't, I mean, my phone was just like, ding, 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 ding. I was like, oh, holy hell, what did I do? And I think I did four listings at a time and he recommended not, but I don't listen. I was like, no, it's this, put them all in. Let's do them all. <laughs> Wendy, didn't you do a Tech Tuesday on Book Me Solid? Uh-huh. Yeah, I thought yeah. I remember seeing that. Okay. It's great. It's a yeah, great Yeah, we've, we've did a couple of them. <clears throat> Oh yeah, Adrian, so, you use Chris, right? Yes, I've used them. Yeah, I like it. It's like, but you do have to have somebody because man, you put a listing on there and it's like Wendy says, ding, 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 like crazy. And you have to be in touch, but it's fabulous. Well, his yeah. name isn't on the site and it's just like pay for it and become a founding member. So do we have some <laughs> contact info for him? Chris Harden. You can find him on Facebook and Instagram and send him a message. Okay. I mean, a, I feel bad that I just sent a million messages to Chris Harden. So if yeah, you I, are oh, there he Chris, is. I know. So anyway, but but yeah, just say, hey, I was on Winnie's Tech Tuesday and she just said how amazing you are. Call me and tell me all about it. H-A-R-D-E-N? D-I-N. Right, Joanne? D-I-N? He's in Georgia. Hold on, I'm yep. looking for him. Yes. Yep. Yeah, I found here. him. Yep. So stalk him. Tell him I said you're welcome. <laughs> anyway, um, okay, so uh Manny Shad does a lot of different things. Uh I was watching some videos this morning trying to figure out something that was in my head that I thought was real, but I don't think it is because I could not find a video to save my life. I thought if someone likes your post, you can auto um, send them a message thanking them for liking your post and, you know, send them to a website to learn more about you or whatever it is. And I can't find it anywhere. I spent three hours before this class looking. <laughs> so I don't know if I just made that shit up in my head or if it's real, but if anybody knows what I'm talking about and how to do it, please raise your hand. Please come forward. And uh, I even had Liz Brown working on it this morning at five o'clock in the morning. <laughs> I was like, this is terrible. I know this is a thing. And what are you trying to do? You're trying to reply to everybody who replies? No. If someone likes your post, then you automatically send them a message. Thanks for liking my post. Here's my contact card or here's my website to learn more about what I do or whatever it is. I'm just, I thought there was an auto message. Carrie Thompson, are you here? We were talking about I don't about think she's yesterday. on it. Her picture is here. That's all I uh -oh. see. My masking to unmute. But anyway, Wendy. Yeah. When I I went on YouTube and looked it up, and the one two ladies on there said there's no way for you that they won't allow you to do that. 
I know. So maybe they took it away. Maybe it was a thing and then they took it away. So I also started learning that you could actually do um, uh, stories. So like uh, if someone, you know, comments on your story, you could do something. But it's all about a comment. So Manny Chat could do comments uh, here. So uh, I just want to show you one more thing inside here. So this is what we are doing for a specific post, right? So if you go to automation and you go to keywords, again, if you cannot see keywords, it's because you do not have a pro version. So new keyword, see how, um, okay, so I'm going to show you this one. If you tell someone in your, um, if you tell someone in any of your posts to say sell in the comments, right? So you could do multiple seller posts and just use the one word, right? So uh, basically the home or the keyword is sell and it can be on any post, right? So this one here, see how it says any post? So you could do it either per post. Remember how I picked the Vera Condo post? Or you could do any post. This way, you only have to create this once and it could go, you know, to whatever you want. But, um, uh, and then it sends this to any post. Remember, you don't have to do this anymore. So there we go. Uh, create your um, auto uh, public response. We're going to click save. This is where they're going to go. Okay. So um, they're going to go here. I don't know. Oh, it's it's live, so it's not going to let me edit it unless I click edit. But anyway, it all starts with your home value. Click below to see how much we can get for yours. And then this goes right to my home value thing. So like if you're looking for free leads, right, this is a super easy way to do it. Um, or you can do all of this right in street text and run ads behind it and get like 10 times the amount of words in your comments. So, uh, Adrian. Yeah, you, you created several auto responses. So um, Facebook or Instagram still like you. Are those auto responses, do they rotate? Yes. Okay. Yeah, so if you look at this here, if I go to here, uh, no, where's my, oh, Instagram. Okay, and if you look at my, this is the pool one, right? So right. if you look at this, Lanny typed pool. So there, sweet, check your DMs. And it has my little bikini on it, right? This one says, uh, oh, sweet, check your DMs. Awesome, check your DMs. So okay. see how it's like different? Uh, mm -hmm. There's check your DMs, this one. Okay, there's a lot of bathing suit ones. They must really like this one. So it's rotating through a couple of them, but enough to keep me out of trouble. So okay. um, anyway, and then uh, just make sure you, you know, do like their comment. And and when you like their comment and reply, it actually helps your post. Okay, perfect. Thank you. All right. You're welcome. Wendy, with, yes. with the amount of leads that are coming in that you are conversing with through these programs, what do you think the conversion is for those? Well, it all depends on what you're sending to them, right? So okay. when, I, when I say type tech in the comments below and they get a link to my Tech Tuesday to join, guess what? They're joining, right? So that's like oh. 100%. That's okay. like a hundred percent when you're giving totally get it. someone something that they want, right? They're going to do the thing. So the home value one, did you see how it was only like 75% of the people clicked the actual link, right? So not a hundred percent of the people clicked it, 75%, because a lot of people are like, oh, this is a trick. <laughs> They're going to suck me into their database and spam me with a bunch of emails, blah, blah, blah. Right. So anyway, but um, like I've did a lot of them um, uh, to agents talking to them about hitting that, 
you know, higher price point and doing luxury, right? So I'm like, for more information about how I hit a higher price point, type luxury in the comments below. So now when anybody ever types luxury, uh, they're automatically getting a little mini mastermind link to mini mastermind with me about luxury. You know what I mean? So it's all about where you're sending it and if they want it bad enough, right? So, and I kind of feel like that, with anything. Like when I do a Facebook ad on, you know, my Raider calendars or Golden Knights calendars, right? And I say, hey, I got my schedule in. Who wants one? Guess what? They're going to give you good name, email, phone number, address, because they want the thing, right? Cool. If it's about a home value, you know, you're, you're going to get some information, you know? Uh, so, and and if you were doing a webinar, would you use this for a webinar? Absolutely. Yeah, you okay. can promote anything through this. You can sell anything through this. Do you think I sell a lot of stuff from my stand store using this? Oh, yes. Yeah. Okay. If you want more information, type here. And then, boom, my stand store link goes right into their DMs. So, and yes, if you are selling anything, do it. Those results then are... um are found or street text um takes care of what the results are the percentages and stuff you can see it through there or what system right, so shows street you. text has nothing to do with what i showed you today <laughs> right if we yeah, yeah. were to post that veer condo uh video inside street text and then i had you know uh, for more information about this sweet high rise type veer in the comments below right and I ran an ad behind that and people typed Veer in the comments, they're going to get the message. So it can work for reels. It can work for posts. It can work for ads. So, but yes, Where then you, you would know, then you would know because people are going to give their name, email, and phone number to get the thing. Okay. So that was kind of the little exercise we did earlier on but I was just looking where you, I was trying to figure out where you in all the systems find the percentage of what is working and well not working yeah, but in the mani chat the you can see the keyword oh, okay. and you can pull right. it up and it tells you who how many people clicked on it and then what percentage actually clicked the button inside messenger okay so so it gives the stats right inside of there so if i go back here i'll show you real quick uh going back to mani chat uh see how this was um Got four it. people clicked on this right and then right here it says three people opened it and 25 percent clicked this is a home value one that's why it's wow. like not everybody's gonna do the thing you know you want them to do that's the thing cool. and you're gonna set it up but yeah it's very cool so if you go wow. into like let's see uh this one So 10 uh, sent message, 10, 100% delivered, uh, two people open, 10% clicked on beer condo. That was the Instagram one. So that's okay, like keep so, track of your numbers on steroids. <laughs> I know, that's I know. So wow. you can also, I, I was watching a video <laughs> this morning about building your email database. So like you can have a message saying, you know, put your email below um, uh, and I'll send you the thing. So let's say you're, you know, giving 10 tips, right? So you find whatever you're going to click on, 10 tips to getting um, top dollar for your home. You know, 10, 10 things you could do to your home to get top dollar or whatever you want to say, right? So you say that in your post or your reel or whatever. And then they, and, and you have them, you know, put um, tips as the keyword, right? So they type tips in the keyword, it goes into there and you can even have the automation say, uh, great, where should I send this? What's the best email? And then they put their email in there and then you have their email. So if you want their email, otherwise you're literally having a conversation with that person. You don't need it, but building an email database is huge because you can do so many things with them once you get them into your CRM. 
So, um, yeah, uh, I want to share this. I don't, I don't know her, but, uh, let's see. I sent it to Liz Brown this morning. Let's see. Liz Brown. This was the one. I'll send this to you Since guys. we started implementing this Instagram strategy, I've been able to engage well over 13,000 email lists. Of email list of 13,000. Who wants that? So here's this. So that's a video that I watched this morning. You can learn more about that. But I'm not going to lie. As soon as she like <laughs> went into her crazy little diagram of everything that happens like I shut down I was like oh this is this is probably what I would need to pay Chris for <laughs> so much in that automation I like immediately started breaking out in a sweat <laughs> so I like simple this is simple something that everybody can do and I know everybody's always talking about organic traffic, free leads. Like this is this is a good way to get that. Um, we're going to talk a little bit more about this um, with uh, on a couple Tuesdays from now, where we're going to talk about free marketing. So we're going to have. I was trying to shoot for a list of a hundred different things you could do to market yourself for free, but I don't know if I can hit a hundred. So we're just going to say it's a whole class of what to do for free marketing because I know everybody's looking to uh you know not spend a million dollars and it seems like every time I have a class everybody has to whip out their paycheck oh wait wait a minute they do have to whip out their checkbook because if you don't have many chat pro you're gonna have to buy it sorry see I did it again but there is gonna be one that's totally free <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's funny. Okay, um, any questions about mini chats? We have a couple more minutes. Um, did I blow everybody's mind? Are you super excited to start the process? Uh, what else did I have? I had PDFs. PDFs are good. Like, you know, that's why they have PDF Facebook ads, right? You could do PDFs right through a post and freaking have them, you know, message or... Um, message a keyword to the comments and then you could just you know ask for their email if you want or just send them a link to your um uh, your pdf um whatever it is that it is so uh list of homes send peeps to website um oh get peeps to like your business page so a lot of people are like, how do I get people to like my page? This has nothing to do with Manny Chat. <laughs> but let's say, uh, let's say. This is great. I love it. So you get the list from Mojo and then you like can help. I know that guy. Okay. Um, Post. Let's see. I could do it from here. I want to go. Uh. Mm -hmm. I think I have it better off with my business ads. Like, I don't know why it's not showing stuff. Uh, like, all my things are hidden. I don't know why. Maybe I have to go through here. Oh my gosh. Okay, we are not going there. Uh, anyway, if you are running ads on your um, Facebook and Instagram, uh, and then you have a whole bunch of likes, right? So you go into where you can see all the likes, click on the likes, and then you can click invite, 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 invite. You can invite the people that liked your posts to like your Facebook page and that gets even more engagement and they can follow you even better. So, um, so that's how I do it. I actually do it through my phone. So I don't even know what I'm doing on the computer trying to figure that out. But, uh, every time someone likes or, you know, does something on one of my, <clears throat> my ads, it comes up in my notifications and then I click there and then I click on, you know, the heart 
And I just start inviting everybody that I've never invited to my page. So that's why we have so many followers because we just use um, our, our posts and our uh, likes to invite people to like more. So anyway, awesome. All right. Well, we have Can five I, minutes left. Anybody have questions? I have one, one like observation. So I went in, created by Manny Chat, paid for um, the $15 pro but it still says free. So it looks like it still gives you the free, you know, few days or whatever. And I guess then that's what it's going to charge. Just an FYI. Right. So do you see keywords though, when you click on I automations? Do. Oh, you do? I do. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Awesome. All right. Yeah. I didn't know uh, what that would give you. Cause I know when people, I told them about it before and they, they did the 14 free trial, 14 day free trial. It still didn't show up until they went pro. So, so you probably have to like actually do the thing. No, no, no. What I'm saying is, is I went pro. It shows the keywords, but it still also says free. So what that in, what that tells me is maybe I'll get it free before they start charging it. I don't know. Cool. Awesome. It says free. Yeah. We like free. Okay. So if you don't have Manny chat, Joanna, put it in the chat. Uh, click the link to um, do that. Uh, if you need help with these crazy things or setting up your own automation, we do that in VIP. Uh, there's also a VIP um, uh, link right there. Uh, make sure you use TT to get 20% off your first month. It's only $49 a month for four or five sessions, depending on how many Tuesdays there are. And um, yeah, we actually press the button and build things. So anyway, I'm going to hop off because six people filled out the Tech Tuesday VIP form. So we're going to have a lot of work to do today. And I'm going to suck down my shake real quick so I can have all the energy I need. <laughs> all right, you guys. Well, have an amazing week. And we'll see you next week where my videographer, Eon Jones, you've already met him. He's amazing. He's actually going to be talking about the do's and don'ts of video. So he sees a lot of agents out there doing videos the wrong way. So he's going to give a bunch of tips like what to use, the best apps, the best mics. So all that good stuff. So if you guys uh, need some tips and tricks on video, it's obviously not to replace him because they're still amazing at what they do, but we should also be doing more marketing in between that amazing video they do for our properties. You know what I mean? So anyway, it's going to be super fun. Uh, I will see you there. Let me know if you have any questions, guys.